welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be unboxing my BoxyCharm by Ipsy box for September 2023. I'm so excited. Also because it is my birthday month, but I can't wait to show you guys the products. I got mostly makeup and one skincare product. Also, don't mind my voice. I have a little bit of a cold right now. I know I sound a little nasally. The first product we've got is by Dermalactives, and this is their Energizing Body Lotion. It's 6.76 fluid ounces. It is a pretty large size. This was nice to see. We don't get a lot of body products in here, so seeing this is nice. It's a nice change. Although this the seal does not seem to want to come off. All right, I poked a little pinhole in it. Let's see. It's just a white lotion. It smells pretty good. It kind of smells like those hotel lotions, but it feels really nice and lightweight. If you're looking for something like summertime, I feel like this would be nice. It almost feels like a gel cream, but it's got like the kind of florally scent to it. I like it. It seems to be absorbing actually pretty quickly. It's got pretty good ingredients looking at the ingredient list. Shea butter, olive oil, vitamin E, vitamin A, vitamin C, collagen. Can't wait to use this a little bit more, but I just really like how lightweight it is. Moving on to our next product. We've got Laura Geller. This is the Soft Satin Six Matte Eyeshadows and Two Highlighters. This palette is super cute. I love all the floral pieces on it. Oop. And we do have a broken shade. One of the highlighters is broken. It's okay though. This was sent to me in PR, but I'm not gonna complain because I don't like too much product waste. It's a quick, easy fix. If you wanna hack, if you ever break any palettes and don't know of this one, you can spray some alcohol on there and kind of like pound it down together and then it should go back in place. These are pretty matte shades, neutral browns, and then the highlighters seem to be a little bit on the warmer side. We've got a golden one and then one that's kind of a little bit like a rosy gold. I'm not going to tip it too much so it doesn't spill. Really pretty colors. Today with this unboxing, I will be doing a makeup look as well. So make sure to stick around for that. The next product I've got is by Tarte and this is their Man Eater Waterproof Mascara. I like the Tarte mascaras. I feel like they're pretty nice. This is what the brush looks like. So it looks like this one's a little bit more for lengthening your lashes and adding a little bit of volume, but more so for length. And then the next product we've got is by Key Soul Care. This is the Comforting Tinted Lip Balm. It's in the shade Sheer Bliss. I like the packaging to this. It's nice and glossy, catches the light really nicely. It's like that pretty red shade, but as I'm swatching this, it actually doesn't come out super red, so don't be scared if you don't like red. It's coming out a little bit darker, actually, and a lot more sheer. Gives you that nice pop of color without being too over the top if you want to keep it kind of a little bit more subtle, but still add some color to your look. And then the last product I've got is by Danessa Myricks. I don't have any Danessa Myricks products, so I'm really, really excited about this one. This is the Infinite Chrome Micro Pencil. Oh, so pretty. Look at that packaging. That is absolutely gorgeous. I can't wait to do an eye look with this. All right, let's see. Ooh, so pretty. Okay, I'm gonna try to do a wider swatch so that way you guys can see it. Look how pretty that is. Oh my goodness, that is so glowy. How it catches the light, that's beautiful. It's kind of like a whitish shade, but it reflects with the light and kind of gives you that bluey pink tone to it. So we've got an eyeliner, body lotion, eye products. So let's go ahead and start part two where I create a look with these products. All right, I'm gonna start off by applying just a little bit of my own concealer from a previous BoxyCharm box so that the eyeshadow will stick nicely to my eyes. All right, so we got a little bit of concealer on. We're gonna go in now with my Laura Geller palette. This is the Laura's Essentials. I'm going to start off with the shade Silky using a fluffy eyeshadow brush, and I'm just gonna kind of work this all over my lid as a base. So very subtle, but we're gonna go in next and we're gonna darken it up a little bit. I'm gonna go in with the shade Striking right here and I'm gonna work this into my crease and blend it over. So 
So if you guys are interested in trying out Ipsy or BoxyCharm by Ipsy, these products, you get five full-size products every month and you get to test out a wide variety of products. Sometimes I feel like they do have more makeup versus skincare and some months I feel like they have more skincare versus makeup. Kind of just depends on the month. I'm one of those people where I love skincare products. So I love, love, love the skincare side of things. Also love makeup, of course, as well, but I'm a skincare junkie you get a chance to try out a lot of really cool products and a lot of brands that sometimes you wouldn't necessarily go out and purchase on your own so i feel like it's a great subscription to try out products that you wouldn't normally purchase or just to get your hands on new and growing brands or products that just come out all right i'm gonna go on with the shade stunning it's this darker brown shade and i'm just working this into that outer crease darkening it up creating that little shadow but it's cool also because you can find brands that are super popular like on social media with influencers or also brands that are up and coming that you may not have heard about that have amazing products that you get to try as well but i really like the beauty subscription services they're a great way to get your hands on products and good value as well so I'm going to take the Danessa Myricks Lilac Quartz Eyeliner Pencil and we're just going to go ahead and drag a line across my eye. This is so beautiful. Look how pretty that is. So, so pretty. I'm kind of just using what's in the box today just so you guys can see a look with these products. But if you wanted to make this eyeliner really stand out, what you could do is use a black eyeliner base, let it dry and put this over top of it. Or you could do it where you create kind of like two lines where you put this over top of the black liner. Or what you could do is take a colored eyeliner, like a white eyeliner, for example, and you could take a white eyeliner and draw a line under it and do this over top or create that second dairy line if you wanted to. I feel like on its own, you can definitely see it, but it definitely will pop more if you add a liner underneath. Let's go ahead and add some mascara. We're gonna use the Tarte Maneater Waterproof Mascara. This is what the brush looks like. It is a pretty long brush. The bristles are very small. Like I said, this is more for lengthening your lashes. I feel like a little bit less for volume and more for length. Like immediately, if you go on with like a coat or two, I can see it separating my lashes. It's giving me like that natural look with the fine lashes that also darkens them up a bit. Definitely a more natural looking mascara. I do like it though. Some mascaras I feel like are too natural, but this is kind of like the glam natural mascara, if it makes sense. So it still gives you that little bit of oomph. I'm gonna move on to my lips. Add a little pop of color. This is the Key Soul Care Sheer Bliss shade of their lip balm. Oh wow, okay, so it's a little bit more color than I was expecting, but still not as as red. So definitely a nice pop of color. I really love this eyeliner. I think it's so pretty. I personally probably would have gone for a little bit more of a neutral lip, but kind of showing you guys just how these products work and everything. I like the formula a lot for the lip. I do think overall that these products work really nicely. If you're interested in subscribing to Ipsy, I do have a link down below. Feel free to check it out. I think it's a great subscription for testing out new beauty products if you're a beauty product junkie like myself. I hope you guys enjoyed this little tutorial using my products today. Let me know what you thought of these products down below and stay tuned for my next video. I've got my Ipsy Glam bag to show you guys as well. So stay tuned. Thank you all for watching. If you haven't, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.